everybody it's thursday and thursday package day right Let's see what we got in here Ooh. this is the sharp atomic wall clock images 80 percent of the actual size so let's see there was some complaints about this thing not being as big as they said it was so hopefully it's not all packing and packaging and box hopefully there's some clock in here <clears throat> um, I think I have a packing slip in here somewhere there it is. All right. <clears throat> packing slip is which one is it sharp uh, atomic clock Never needs setting, easy to read, numbers, indoor, outdoor temperature, wireless outdoor sensor. 5524 <clears throat> plus tax. The reason I got this is because I was like, you know what? <clears throat> it would be cool to have an outside temperature. The way I wouldn't have to ask Alexa, Alexa every morning for the weather report. So, without further ado, let me go ahead and aim this down so you guys can see. We have, this must be the external sensor. I'm going to sit on the windowsill. And there you can also put a nail or something through it. There's a, you need two AA batteries. I'll get those at the dollar store. And then, pretty good size clock. <clears throat> Peel the cover off here. And we need, looks like, is that four double A's? So it does not come with batteries. <clears throat> so you're going to need some batteries here. Let me get out my uh, handy dandy battery box. It seems like for 50 bucks they would give you at least a few batteries, right? Even cheap batteries. <clears throat> but I do like they have... Um, this big uh, stand to set it up if you want to set it up on your desk and then they have two gigantic holes or three if you want to uh, put screws or thumbtacks or whatever in it to uh, hold it up <clears throat> but it's just it looks like the same as all the other ones <clears throat> and pretty easy to reset <clears throat> throw this down here And just for <clears throat> um, uh, scale of size, I'm going to go ahead and open this one too. I got this other one because <clears throat> it was cheaper and for my other room. This is uh, was only 28 bucks. It just has indoor temperature, but it does not have outdoor temperature. So, but what's cool is the, this actually comes with batteries. So. I don't know why they can't throw a few batteries in there with the other one, because who wants to go to the store? I usually have batteries, but it's so nice to include them, right? So here's the here's the um, smaller one for 28, and then this one is 55. So it's definitely a size comparison. And also, too, this one has the outdoor weather um, monitor. So you guys just want a small indoor temperature one for uh, you know 30 bucks or you can get the big one with outdoor temperature for 55 bucks so it's up to you what you need uh, I like them both but I just thought it'd be cool to have a big a big one with uh, <clears throat> so I could tell the outside temperature so let me grab some batteries and I will be right back <clears throat> All right, this is also another handy thing to have. You can get these off Amazon. Uh, they're just a battery, a battery holder, and they have a tester in them too. So I usually keep, even some of my used batteries I keep because, you know, for clocks and stuff like that, they're still, still decent. And I keep like the better ones on one side. <clears throat> so 
and they have this little tester in here. So in case you uh, lose track and you forget which, which ones are better than others, if you want to keep or you just want to throw them away, this one is like dusted. <laughs> this one I should have threw away. It is like completely shot and it's, it's corroding my box. So anyway, these, this one isn't even registering barely yeah this one's like hardly any good this one's yeah these are toast I'll go ahead and get rid of those <clears throat> see if we have any better ones over here oh boy these are not very good this one's decent this one's okay. How about these up here? Oh, these are good. I'm gonna go up here. Looks like we got some good ones up here. That one's okay. That one's good. It's <clears throat> okay. Alright, I'm going to try these. I think I need one more. So, this, I think this will be good for, <clears throat> good enough to test it out. So at least that way, make sure it works. But I'll go to the dollar store. I got a dollar store like right down the street. And uh, I'll pick up a couple of these batteries. So that way I won't, I won't have to... Uh, replace them that often. The battery, these clocks don't take much, so. Look how big that is, isn't that nice? So it's an extra 20 bucks, but you get, um, you know, both the uh, indoor and outdoor temperature, and it's a little bit heavier, so they <clears throat> requires a little bit more to uh, hold it up, but hey, I'm not complaining. Yeah, that one's okay. That one's good. That one's good. And I usually just go to the dollar store and I'll pick up a few extra batteries here and there, you know, just to have them. Because you know, every once in a while you order stuff and they don't have batteries. So, and then there's your outside temperature just popped in. So, there's no program or anything. You just pop batteries in and you automatically have the temperature. <laughs> but it's, uh, it's a little, it's close, it's about one degree off, but it'll give you the basic scoop. It should be both the same temperature, but anyway, at least it's within one degree of the, each other. <clears throat> I don't know what the, I'll have to check my uh, radar and see what, what it says. So that's that one. And then let's go ahead and peel this off and put this, put some, uh, batteries in this one I like these as well they're uh, pretty handy all right I just had some batteries here I stick, I'm gonna stick them up. <clears throat> just stick them back in the box yep <laughs> these have a little plastic coating on them I already ordered one of these uh, last week and I really liked it I thought it was a pretty good value, so I ordered another one for the other room, and uh, pretty easy to program. If you need to see me program this, <laughs> you can get the other video. I'm not, I'm not going to program this right now, but I will show you what it looks like. And they're supposed to be self-programming too, but last time I had to program it myself. But you only have to do it once, and then as long as you keep batteries in it, it, it pretty much stays programmed. So, there you go. Peel the sticker off. It looks like it's cracked or something. 
and it has like a little so I'm looking at it weird so yeah it has that little thing on there I don't know if it got broken shipping or what but hopefully that'll go away if not hopefully it won't get any worse so it's definitely either damaged or um, in shipping or it just got a uh, too hot or something anyway so that's something you want to watch out for and you want to put batteries in right away this could be returned um, I'll watch for the next couple days if it gets any worse I'll have to return it and <clears throat> maybe got dropped or something or it could just be defective so there you go these are uh, don't always come out perfect as you can see I mean I can deal with that but if it gets any worse you can't read it it's kind of like useless so all right, this is Roger with Roger's Reviews on the two uh, atomic clocks that you're supposed to not have to set. <laughs> but I've had to set them uh, so far. So I yeah. might have to keep that box because I might be returning that one. All right, I'll see you in the next one. Take care. Be safe out there.